Hey, it's Allison from Mahalo.com, and today we're going to write numbers in scientific notation. Now, this is the general form of a number in scientific notation. A times 10 to the power of n, and A is supposed to be greater than or equal to 1, but less than 10. Now, that might seem kind of confusing, but there's a good reason for it. If A is 10 or greater, it means you have an extra power of 10 here that you could get rid of and put into the exponent. Let's do an example, and you'll see what I mean. Let's take 23,415 and write it in scientific notation. Now, whenever I want to write in scientific notation, I have to locate where the decimal point is in my number and then move it over so many positions. So, what we're going to have here in scientific notation, we want this value, our a, to be greater than or equal to 1 or less than 10. So, if I wrote 2.3415, this number is greater than or equal to 1, but it's still less than 10. And then this is going to have to be multiplied by some power of 10. Now, here's how you figure out the power of 10. In a whole number like this, even though we don't always see it, the decimal point is sitting right there. So, what I have to do is see how many positions did I move the decimal point to get this number here. So, we start here and just count. 1, 2, 3, 4. I moved the decimal place 4 positions. So that means that my exponent is 4. So that takes 23,415 and writes it in scientific notation. 2.3415 times 10 to the power of 4. Now, if I had written it like this, 23.415 times 10 to the power of decimal place was here and I moved it one, two, three places. This isn't technically scientific notation because this number is greater than 10. I can still pull one more power of 10 out of it as I did here and write it as 2.3415 times 10 to the power of 4. That's how you write a number in scientific notation and we're going to do another example of it. So click here. Thanks for learning with me today. If you like this video and would like to learn more about related topics, click on any of the links below. And please remember to rate, like, or subscribe to our channel. If you have any specific questions or requests, please send them to requests at mahalo.com. I'll see you later.